Shamed by Gino for pubic hair? I have phases where I just let all my body hair grow for like half a year. During one such phase I went to my gynecologist for a routine checkup and he complained that I didn't even trim. I naturally don't have excessive amounts of body hair and also I have very good hygiene, so that couldn't have been the issue. So, is this normal? Shouldn't he be used to working with this? I once had a nurse be rude about it. I was getting prepped for a C-section. Whether I shaved or not otherwise I don't know how she expected me to do it at 39 weeks pregnant the other nurse actually glared at her. It's totally inappropriate to comment on this. This is inappropriate and totally unprofessional. I had a woman gyno once mildly comment that the hair was there for a reason and that one of them was to reduce bacterial infection and the such. It was more doctorly chit-chat about the then-growing trend of shaving than a scolding, so no biggie. But I remember looking it up it appears to be true. I can't in the least imagine why a doctor would complain about the opposite. Sounds pretty out of line. Sorry you had to experience that during an already invasive appointment. Oh can you please make sure to note that on my chart so the nurse can remind me before I come in again. And then if he declines you can bully him for free and make a complaint. How absolutely unprofessional and gross of him tbh. He shouldn't be making comments at all. And he should be used to public hair. Report him and get a new doctor. Any gynecologist who comments on how your pubes look has got to go. As a gynecologist, the variety is tremendous, the choices are personal, I can't remember what it looked like the second you leave the office, and none of it makes any difference to me. Oh no. You would be within your right to report him to your state's medical board. When I got bit by a brown recluse on my leg year, seriously a male doctor shamed me for having stubble on my legs and said that my poor hygiene would lead to the wound becoming more infected. Face with rolling eyes. Disgusting and unprofessional. This guy shouldn't be a gyno. You need a new doctor. Very inappropriate. Nope. That is low-key body shaming and a medical professional should never body shame a patient. It could deter people from seeking medical treatment again. If he is in a practice, alert the office manager about his comment. LOL OMG no no absolutely not. Body hair is perfectly normal. He is disgusting. And don't you dare let him make you feel bad about yourself his being an ass, pure and simple. Report him and get you a doctor who actually wants to treat human bodies. He should catch up with my gynecologist during my last internal exam he complained that my vagina was breaking his fingers. I reckon they'd get on. Why do these men go into gynecology at all? It's so unpleasant to deal with them. WTF? I have never shaved, waxed etc. my pubic hair. Never had a doctor make a comment about the state of my pubic hair. Highly inappropriate. Hell during the winter I don't even shave my legs anymore. No one, including physical therapists has said anything. Report his ass. I would report the shit out of that doctor. Report and move on. Hair exists in our bodies. That is our literal natural state. Even suggesting that you must trim your hair for some people this even goes against religious beliefs is entirely inappropriate and unprofessional. You think docs are telling men to shave their assholes before their prostate exams? Yikes. Drop this gyno if possible. There is no reason to comment on your hair unless it's about hygiene pubic hair is not inherently unhygienic or ingrown hairs. 25 years as a male of GYN. That's way out of line. Completely unprofessional. I imagine the state medical licensing board has a few complaints lodged against that guy. I have never trimmed. If a gyno dared to comment on this I would inform them they were way overstepping what was acceptable behavior from a professional, and I would lay a formal complaint. Male gyno scare me. My mom's made some horrible and disgusting comments about her weight, looks. This is not okay. He should be a professional. I'm sorry this happened to you. 
please report him so it hopefully won't happen to anyone else. Would he say this to a 14 child having her first exam or an 80 year old? No, because they aren't sexual but you are prime meat expected to present your hoo-ha in a pleasing manner to him. I'd be reporting him before I got up off that table. I was hair shamed by a female nurse and the doctor shut her down, was pretty satisfying. Absolutely his problem, not yours. Leaving your pubes alone is better for you, if anything providers should absolutely support you. It's your body, your choice. Thanks doc but I'm not here to be pretty. And you're not here for a pussy pageant so let's just get on with the medical part shall we? I'm sorry that happened to you, he was being so unprofessional you should definitely report him, he had no business shaming you for something normal and natural. My NP shamed me because I do shave regularly, so we really can't win do whatever works for you, other people's opinions don't matter. I'm sorry but I refuse to see a male gynecologist and stories like this make me feel validated in that decision. Wow your doctor is a misogynistic asshole and this is so unprofessional on so many levels. Unless the hair is physically impeding a medical procedure or a symptom of a serious illness, there are zero reasons for your doctor to make a comment about, or even have an opinion on, your natural body hair. The hair is normal, if it wasn't, it wouldn't grow there. Find a different doctor and report this one. He shouldn't be practicing if that's how he acts. That is grossly unprofessional and mildly perverted, pubic hair is entirely natural, and no one should be made ashamed by their body hair. He needs a new profession, that is such a gross thing to say. Especially considering the vulnerability of seeing a gyno and a male one at that. That was wildly inappropriate for him to say. If this happened recently, it's worth lodging a complaint. OMG no this is not normal. Report this. Absolutely not okay. I apologize to my doctor once for not shaving. His exact words I'm not here to judge your fashion choices. Kick this gyno to the curb. I only shave my underarms haven't shaved my legs in years never have shaved my pubic hair. I had surprise ankle surgery last year, so they had to do some patchy shaving for that, my one leg looked pretty raggedy. I mentioned how uneven it looked to my PT1 session that maybe I should shave part of my leg, he said, don't start shaving on my account. So I didn't even tidy it up. He never complained never commented beyond that. Find you a new gyno who understands how body hair works. Report him to the medical board and your insurance company. That is highly inappropriate of him to say that. What the actual fuck? I've only ever heard of gynecologists saying the exact opposite. Clean-shaven pubic areas have a much higher risk for vaginal and urinary tract infections. Granted I've never had a male gynecologist. He needs to trim his mouth. Pubic hair isn't a diagnosis. I once had a GYN tell me I was just as cute with my clothes on as I was when they were off. It was pretty disturbing, as I was pretty young and didn't know there was anyone to tell. Not a male doctor either. I'd trim the gyno if I were you. Dump his ass it's his fucking job. This is why I generally hate doctors until they prove me otherwise so many are arrogant assholes. I hope you complain about him seriously. Gross. He shouldn't be commenting on your body hair at all. I'd report Hun or leave a review and find a new gyno. Most healthcare providers barely notice pubic hair because we are focused on your health. This is disturbing. Honey, I literally have never trimmed my pubic hair, and I am kinda hairy for a CIS female. That's shameful for a doctor to say to you. I regularly let my leg hair just grow ha ha. What a weirdo. Gynos deal with women at all stages of ILFA, including older women who are physically incapable of or unwilling to shave themselves anymore. So they see more bush than Versailles gardeners. Why this weirdo would mention your hair specifically sounds like it was some inappropriate attempt to joke or flirt. Either way, gross, glad he's not your doctor anymore.